Hey guys, it's Andrew Murray here, and I just wanted to explain a couple things about uh, about blogs. First off, um, you know, there's a difference between uh, posts and pages. Pages are more things where you know you're not going to have in your in your stream of of, uh, of new stuff. So that will be pages that that will be on like the navigation bar. You know, it's like a home page about this site. You know, that kind of thing, as well as you know, thank you pages, you know, or, you know, behind the scene pages or, or, or sales pages, things that, that, that wouldn't go in the normal stream of a blog. Most of your normal content will actually be posts, right? And that just, um, you know, will, will, uh, is, is going to be a way where you, where you add most of your content to your blog. So that's the difference between pages and posts. And the other thing that's important to understand is, is plugins. One of the reasons WordPress is so, awesome is because it's a great stable platform and plugins just bring added functionality into it. So for example, you know, this, this plugin, uh, AskiMet, what this one does is this prevents spam. Uh, AWeber forms, this one allows you to easily link to your AWeber account and add a form in your sidebar, um, which, which is, is usually done through, uh, through the widget. Um, this one here, ping optimizer, you know, make sure that you don't over ping your, your blog. Click bump SEO, this one analysis, uh, analysis uh, does an SEO analysis and, you know, tells you if your on-page SEO is good. Um, dig dig, this one just adds, you know, social media buttons to your site. You can customize it to go at the top of the post or the bottom of the post or, you know, um, on the side. Um, so all these different plugins, you know, have a, have a purpose. You know, here's one that's um, uh, does Google Analytics. This one does a video sitemap. This one does, you know, just your, your typical XML sitemap. And what this what these really do is this just kind of uh, these, these just add functionality to your uh, to your site. You know, uh, there's also ones where you can you know create a, a pop up, right? Um, and so it adds things to your WordPress site and with plugins, you want to have the right plugins. That's really the key, but don't worry so much about this, you know, just get going on, on building your blog and over time you'll become comfortable with plugins, you know, and what I usually do is I'll test something, you know, you can always uh, deactivate it, you know, later, but, um, but just be just be aware of, of basically WordPress is is the posts, the pages, and the plugins. That's how you really get you know uh, those are the places where you're going to be spending your time in in your WordPress back office.